This morning, the State Department raised the worldwide travel advisory to level three, urging all U.S. citizens to reconsider any travel abroad. For those already overseas, returning to the U.S. is an option. Channel 3's Joy Dukes explains why a Chattanooga woman living in Germany believes getting home may come with challenges. The 30-day travel ban will not impact U.S. citizens who are looking to return home, but Chattanooga native Katie Beard says she still has some concerns. I do know that there are confirmed cases in the city that I'm living in, in Oldenburg, Germany. With her flight back to the U.S. two weeks away, it's a waiting game for Beard, a recent graduate, and her husband, a German citizen. So far, my husband and I, neither one, are sick. But we're very fortunate because the doctors are completely slammed with patients. Though they are both exempt from the travel ban under federal guidelines, she tells Channel 3 she's anxious about the process of getting back home with several connecting flights. I'm happy that I can come and bring my husband. I'm just a bit worried about flights being canceled because the situation with flight is a bit up in the air because if there's not enough American citizens on a flight, they may just cancel it. While the number of confirmed cases of coronavirus creeps to 2,100 in Germany, Beard, who works in a restaurant, says she and her husband are trying to avoid contact with others and stay indoors. I'm just trying my best to not touch people and to <laughs> kind of keep my distance. But the biggest concern she has in coming home is having to limit contact with immediate family members she hasn't seen in a year. My poor family is having the worst time in all of this because they haven't seen me. My dad I haven't hugged in over a year and he is just completely worried. My mom as well because they really have no idea what's going to happen. According to the CDC, travelers who are looking to return to the U.S. are being asked to self-quarantine for a 14-day period and practice social distancing. Reporting in Chattanooga, Joy Dukes, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.